BC Pavco decided to erect a giant electronic billboard right on Terry Fox Plaza, destroying the quality of life for residents of nearby Vancouver condos, dishonoring the Terry Fox Memorial, and most importantly, breaking Vancouver's city bylaw. My question to the minister responsible for Pavco, does he agree with Pavco breaking Vancouver's law? Mr. Johnson, Tourism. Uh, thanks, Mr. Speaker. There has been challenges with the technology uh, implemented at the new BC Flight Stadium. Uh, PAPCO has been dealing with that, and I understand that uh, they have now come to a successful conclusion on it. Member of Supplemental. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. Modifying how you break the law is still breaking the law. This billboard is nearly 2,000 square feet when the law allows 200 square feet. It dominates Terry Fox Plaza with Budweiser ads and it dominates residents' homes with blinding and flashing lights. This billboard needs to be taken down now. Will this Liberal government listen to the City of Vancouver who has requested the sign be removed and stop breaking the law today. Minister. Uh, Mr. Speaker, uh, PAPCO has been working with the City of Vancouver to ensure that we're working within the structure of the approved bylaws. Uh, they have ramped down the number of hours per day that the sign is let, and I believe they've come to a successful conclusion. Modifying how you break the law is still breaking the law. This billboard is nearly 2,000 square feet when the law allows 200 square feet. It dominates Terry Fox Plaza with Budweiser ads and it dominates residents' homes with blinding and flashing lights. This billboard needs to be taken down now. Will this Liberal government listen to the City of Vancouver who has requested the sign be removed and stop breaking the law today. We want them to comply with the sign bylaw and to not have a sign there that is a total pain for the local residents. Mr. Uh, Mr. Speaker, uh, PAPCO has been working with the City of Vancouver. PAPCO has been working with the City of Vancouver. PAPCO has been working with the City of Vancouver. This councillor says PAPCO did not properly touch base with the city. They're ambushed, really. They wake up in the morning and discover that they have this thing in their living room. PAPCO has been working with the City of Vancouver to ensure that we're working within the structure of the approved bylaws. And with, with regards to those sign words, is, is there any update on the, the province coming into compliance with those? They haven't approached us uh, to have any discussions of any sort on uh, removal or adjustment of those signs. Okay. That's good to know.